All right, we're back with part 11. Wow, check this place out. It's like a palace. Talk about class. Let me just drink it all in. Attention, DNA. Friend. So, my guide says I should go to the bottom. So, we're going to do that. No baddies on this level. Oh. Boom. So, we got to reassemble Claire, so we're going down find her parts. Every time. Not that time, though. Oh, he's got the baton. We're in oh! Hey, what? That's what I thought. Oh no. Whoa, whoa, whoa. How did he just phase through the railing? That wasn't fair. Saw me. Boom. Boom. We're just gonna leave it here. All right. Cleaning bots aren't doing very good. It's very dirty. New scanning cycle. Module, limb, leg, left. Not found. <sighs> Just great. So where am I even supposed to look? I swear on my cooling unit, these mustached perverts must have dragged her into the maintenance room. I'm on my way. I like that music. Reminds me of like Looney Tunes or something. Oh, we got one of those in here. So that's where we came from. This place used to be really nice until everybody got killed. It is a most tragic sight. I hate these things. Stupid building robots. Oh, we gotta... Just a display. Go down here first. Whoa, what's that big robot? Whoa. 
Whoa. Screw this, we're not doing this nonsense. No, thank you. They can all come back to life. As long as they can't open that door. I didn't really think about that. Oh, it's one of these. Pressing buttons. Can we go in? Oh. All right. What hey, is this, this is new. You may need to apply spatial reasoning here. There's no may about it. These locks of yours are really something, you know that? Fading data. So what do I do? Let me look I got. Take the plate off the door. Da 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 da. Pretending cog puzzle. I've not done testing ground, so I know I don't know where they are. Couldn't they just put regular, more reliable locks everywhere? Like with codes and shit? I suspect it's because if they had, anyone who hacked the code would be able to open the locks without authorization. Yeah, but now anyone who solves the puzzles can get through. Boom. In other words, pretty much anybody. Hey! Oh! Clever girl. Oh, I just broke him. I like that. Cool. Back to this thing. That's loaded. This is loaded. Boom. Alright. So what do we do? Charles, what do the special neuroconnectors from Sechenov's team look like? The special neuroconnectors have the Greek letter gamma on them and are shaped like bracelets. They are worn on the right arm. Gamma? What happened to Beta? Or are those the fake connectors you told me about? The fake connectors do in fact have the letter beta on them, but the beta connectors were real at first. Uh, 
I don't get it. The first experimental prototypes of the neuro connectors with discretionary authority were called beta connectors. There were only two of them, and Dr. Sechenov designed them to look like rings. So, what happened to them? After the necessary experiments were complete, Dr. Sechenov removed these rings from the list of special neuro connectors. Enhanced gamma models shaped like bracelets were then made for the scientists, one for each member of his team. Okay, there are only seven of those gamma connectors? For Vavilov, Korolyov, Kurchatov, Lebedev, Pavlov, Filomonenko, and Chelome? Indeed. This thing's actually not too bad. And it's unlimited. Oh, come on, I shot him first. Pray to your tin god. I do not have very good accuracy. Alright, I got four of those left. Alright. What's up here? Nothing. All right, moving on. <laughs> not fair, not fair. Hold this for me, would you? Hold this for me, would you? There goes one. For it. That was a lot harder than it should have been. But we survived. Did that really blow him in half? That's cool. Alright. Turn into the puzzle. It says to set it to notch four. That doesn't seem right. Are you looking at the right thing? Huh. On my guide, it literally shows this as notch four, but we have different ones, so. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. I did the wrong thing. Okay. So yes, it needs to be stopped. Dodge for. I was looking at the wrong thing. Whoops. The next one looks like that. No. What? Did they say the wrong thing, maybe? I don't have that one either. Okay, it's supposed to be this one. These notches are all not correct. The 
this way. I'm very confused. Maybe this way. Why did it just pause? Okay. Alright, we climbed out. Ow. I think uh uh <laughs> I did this wrong. Let's try again. These notches do not match up with the guide at all. It is very annoying. these again. Well, this is kind of annoying how my guide literally does not match up with what I'm doing. Too much. And up. So we need to move this one. Got this. And we need that yellow pipe, I guess, on the ground. Where's the thing? Alright, come on. What? What did I do wrong? Do I go in here? Ah, <sighs> now I'm annoyed. Okay, no, so we want the classroom, right? Yeah. We jump down. Here. Now we climb out, right? But the thing's not here. So what gives? What am I doing wrong? Help. I guess we'll hit it again. Is it this one that I climb out of? No. That's the one I came down with. All right, well. Let me find where I was on here. So let's get out. See, this is the kind of point in games where I really like having a skip puzzle option. That's probably my favorite thing in Last of Us, because, God, I, even those little puzzles, it just infuriates me. They come off as just purposeful time wasters, and I absolutely hate them. All right, so this thing wants us to set it to notch four. So notch four. It's the classroom. Drop down through the open doorway the left. Boom. 
We're gonna go all the way to the floor. And now, we're gonna set this to notch four. Climb these to reach the stairway above you. But I swear to God, I've done this. What the hell was that? Reach the door way above. With a third valve. No, see, it's not... What am I doing wrong here? What am I doing wrong? Am I looking at the wrong thing? I might have to sit here and watch a video. Because this is not at all how it's supposed to be going. This is stupid, man. Oh, God. I really didn't want to have to look up a video. Come on. Um, find a way... Oh, whoops. To proceed Atomic Heart. Because I am stuck. And then YouTube my PC goes slow as anything for some reason. Why is YouTube my, like YouTube is literally like every website on my computer goes fast as anything, but YouTube is the slowest website known to mankind for some reason. It is so weird. <coughs> Just show me what I'm doing wrong. All right, killing the robots. Boom, love it. We're getting past the science part in the beginning. Boom, love it. All right, now the video just dropped down to like 140. <sighs> and nothing's here, so we're just gonna. I mean, we're just gonna stand out here because we're stuck. We are stuck. And now YouTube is just sitting here freezing. And like this video was literally three minutes. I've probably what I've been here for what fifteen minutes trying to figure this out. This is absolutely crazy. I got it. So we're going to bring the classroom back while we're waiting. Unless there's like something in here that I'm just completely missing. No. That's where I came from. That door doesn't go anywhere. So there's the classroom. Let's see if mine matches his. Alright, so he made it two. Okay, he just jumped down without even thinking about it. He was playing on a different difficulty. Alright, so he's got the cages. His is on four. Alright, we're gonna go to three. We're gonna go to two. Alright, we're gonna climb up. I swear to god, I've done this like eight times. Am I climbing up on the wrong side? <laughs> Alright, we're gonna pause that video, because, like, literally, doing the same thing. I don't have. There's nothing here for me. What am I doing wrong? I am lost in the sauce right now. 
Is it on this side? No. Alright, we're gonna go back a little bit. Alright, hang on. YouTube froze. Alright, so he drops down. Let's make sure we're setting at the right one. I'm just I'm literally following a video at the same exact spot that I'm at right now. Alright. We have the same exact setup in front of us. Alright. Jumps up. Jumps up to here. Jumps up to here. Jumps up to here. Jumps up to here. What the heck? I don't have this. It's literally completely different. I'm so confused. I think I have a game breaking bug. Wait, this is it. I found it. Ah. Let's go back in the video. Alright, he's climbing up again. We're gonna wait for him to get up. Man, I'm almost at 30 minutes and I have found one body part. This is wild. Alright, so what do we set this to? We set it to... Okay, yeah, I've definitely broken this. Well, we that works. The facility service rooms, Major. Goodness. One of my dear Claire's legs is most certainly there. Yeah, the truth is out there, right? All right, we're gonna move on quick. That was such a waste of time. I've never seen bots like these before. Robot is very dangerous in melee combat. Uh, oh, so that's why I'm getting my ass kicked. Die. Ooh, give me your parts. Give me your parts. Yummy, yummy, yummy. All right. No saving thing yet. We got a leg. We have a leg. Charles, I've never seen Dr. Sechenov wearing a bracelet before. Does his alpha connector look different? Indeed it does. His device is unique. Head up the stairs. And his shape and location are one of Dr. Sechenov's deepest secrets. So his alpha connector must be really well guarded. Who's watching it, Argentum? Entrusting humans with the connector would be far too risky. It's guarded by Dr. Sechenov's personal bodyguards. You mean the ballerina twins? The way they move, they're so graceful and elegant. Friends didn't respond, which is good. All right, we're gonna end this video here. Thing. <laughs> cool tech. All right, so that was Claire's leg. So, yeah, that was not fun. Not fun at all.